Hi, can I beat every single funny game level in just one month? I'm genuinely not sure if I can, considering this insanely influential and legendary creator has a very wacky and long catalog, especially in difficulty. This will also be, you know, structured a bit unusually for me, with me having recorded my live reaction to pretty much everything, so this will be more of a supercut type thing. There will be intermission points where I just review a level, you know, classic Wild Seal style, uh, specifically for the demons I've already beaten before, but most of this will be very unusual for me. For now, just strap in and be ready ready for a variety of mic noises and volume and quality as I try to complete the entire funny game catalog. It's go time. There you go. We're gonna start. It says 0 out of 54. It's probably more. It's like 10 out of 54 for just duty auto levels. Why is the music so fucked? It's just an auto level. It's a good auto level. You're welcome. Cool. That's, um, yes. That's what we like to see. One out of 54. It's a lot of levels. So yes, auto cycles. No, auto back on track. I just don't have anything to say about these. They're just auto levels. This one is actually very well synced, by the way. Especially for how old it is. It keeps thanking me for what? Yes, two out of 10. I have to <laughs> update it again. Also, I won't be rebeating the demons because that's annoying. That's about it. I've actually not beaten this one, apparently. Not let this play out. Yo, look, it's music notes. This is actually such a creative auto level. That's a great auto. And a free star, hell yeah. Okay, so this is where I'm going to introduce load. That's the nine circles to your list. The funny game levels to your list. I had to make this from scratch, by the way. This took like three hours. I'm going to remove the F and E tier because I know work. I'm going to remove the bottom two tiers because I know funny game is too quality for that. So, auto cycles is C tier. Go back on track is C tier. And I actually liked jumper more than the other two. So, I'm going to put that in B tier. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Also, D tier is just for levels that I thought were bad. There's no E or F tier because that's no use. But I do think we're going to have an entry to D tier looking at the title of this one. Very hard, can't let go because it's an old 8 star. I'm just going to do a practice run. Levels are usually f silent. Oh no, he was right. Great. What a good level. No. Yep. Wow. Great. Please work. No, why is it 60 hertz only? I knew there was a blind orb there. This level sucks. <laughs> Maybe I do have to add the E tier. It's also just not creative. What the f is this? Stop with the off screen shit. They gave me a ship part. I'm so used to 360 ship. Your great wrong your this might take me a couple minutes not because it's hard but because it's bad yeah f <laughs> that shit dude no why would you add a fake off-screen orb to your non-demon please <laughs> no <laughs> why yeah that jump fuck why is that a jump why is that a f drop down not a jump I sure don't like this level. The amount of <laughs> off-screen clicks. Why? The sync is actually very good. <laughs> also, yes, upside down mirror is very disorienting. Freeze. <laughs> Why the f <sighs> after that it's free? 60 to 100 is so much easier than this stupid ass cube. Okay, just don't choke. Don't pull an 80x. Yay. I did not like that level. That is bad. <laughs> that level is bad. Dislike. No likey. And I'm going to throw very hard. Can't let go into D tier. That level is not good. <laughs> level zero because this is rated, I guess. I'm not gonna do a practice run to f three star. Hold. Okay, thank you for the instructions. What? <laughs> I could have also just dropped down. It's actually a very good beginner level. Well, there is a triple spike, I guess. Well, okay. That's level zero. Yay, I beat level zero by funny, funny, haha, <laughs> game. I liked it. It's That's the most mediocre thing I've ever played, though. This is so annoying. I have to do this for every f level. So this is level zero. L level zero, C tier. So which one do I like more? I like cycles more than back on track. These are ordered. Nice. Let's see if this one's better. I think he ran out of objects. <laughs> I think he ran out of objects and ideas at the end there. Well, that's fine. Auto base after base. Did I not add auto base after base? Whoops. 
Um, oh, you guys are aren't going to miss that one anyway. Of all of the ones I could have missed, that is easily one of the only ones I just don't give a shit about. Yay! Look, it's auto base after base. Out of nowhere. C tier. Above level zero. I'm gonna beat this easy demon now. Maximum risk. Please don't be bugged. Please don't be bad. 2014, really? That's nine years ago. That's a bad transition. That's a mirror ball. <laughs> wow, that click is weird. This is a demon? Wait, really? Just I just realized it just got to me. This is a demon. <laughs> I did 48 to 100. <laughs> um, you know, I don't think this should be a demon. <laughs> but, you know, this part's like the only somewhat demon-ish part. Even then, <laughs> why am I so bad at memory today? <laughs> Why didn't I hold so free? I'm just playing bad. <laughs> Fucking hell. Am I a baseball player? Cause I'm throwing. Yay. That's a demon, I guess. Flip that from 29. Free demon moment. This is very easy. <laughs> Maximum risk. This is B tier, low B tier. I like it. Well, that's a demon down. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Auto tow. I mean, I'm not bored watching it. Okay, I liked it more than Auto Jumper, I think. Okay, the last one of the first page. Damn it, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. Don't know when I forgot, but I forgot sometime. Nine. Knock M. Okay, this is memory based. I'm doing a practice run. Oh, great. That's 360, I think. Oh, okay, like that. Okay. That's actually tough. Wow. This is harder than the demon. This is way harder than the demon. What the? <laughs> actually, not easy. <laughs> That's. It's a good level. I like it. Just think it's a bit underrated. It's like a nine star. I think this ship was free. Wow, that's actually a pretty decently tight gap for a six or seven star, whatever this is. Jump at the exclamation point. Wow, okay. That part is so weird. Mm, why did I land on a block the first time? I didn't land on the block. Fuck. Fuck. That jump is bad, actually. I'm so bad. It literally indicates which ones you have to hit, and I still fail. Huh? <laughs> That's an old age death. Why is it called knock him anyway? Yay. That's not what it's rated as. That is tough. This probably took me more times than- Yeah, <laughs> 54 attempts for a 7 star. So yeah, that's a pretty tough 7 star. Um, as for rating, I think it's slightly above maximum risk. 9 out of 54. This page looks promising. Good job, me, for using brain cell. Is this a hell level? But this is sick. That's a bit f for an easy demon, but whatever. So it's like some biblical level. Fantastic. That's actually good. I like. This is also not harder than knock M, by the way. <laughs> well, maybe, actually, maybe it's, it is. Why the f did I jump into that? That's so obviously a fake. Great bug. <laughs> oh, that that <laughs> caught me so off guard. <laughs> wow, I'm so f bad. <laughs> UFO is so easy. <laughs> I'm still bad at video games. Bro, th that part just doesn't. F yeah, that works. Okay, I just aligned myself badly. Why? Yay. Even tells me I'm fantastic, which is fact. That's 10. From my pack level, this is not bad. I think it's... But I I enjoyed it less, but I think it's... Nah, who the f*** is getting? This is low B. It's low B. I'm super tired. <laughs> so let's beat Crazy Bolt. Wow, I, I got the whip right. Bam, 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 bam. Is this the first slashing background? Let's find out. Ooh, the swag route, let's go. Yo, I did the swag route, let's go. Woo! <laughs> My microphone decided to <laughs> go see God or something. No way. <laughs> oh, wow, that's very disorienting. You win. What a good level. <laughs> that was really good. Let's not screw it up. I'm such a raffle crafter. <laughs> also, this level doesn't have any 360 hertz bugs, which is very surprising. Why the f- Wow. 
I love that he kept the saw blade. It's like easily the best part of Clutterfunk. Why? Why do you add jumps like that? Good level. Very, very good level. Actually, really enjoyed that. Easily. Easily my favorite so far. I really enjoyed that. I like dubstep sound. I don't, but this level slaps. I have carpal tunnel. 31 attempts. Um, crazy. And bolt. <laughs> Around crazy and bolt. Do, do keep that in mind when you're beating this. This is both crazy and bolt. Anyway, that's an A tier. Easily. Might even be S. Not gonna lie. I I thoroughly enjoyed that. Okay, I'll just record auto club step then. I know this part is cool. Inspired Tartarus, probably. Kanye West crucifixes. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> the best audio quality. Thank you, everyone. What is his obsession with thanking people? Is he Canadian? Yeah, that was auto club step. Did you guys enjoy auto club step? Auto club step. There it is. Mm, high, high B tier. Good place for auto club step. After a short break that instead of being short took like four hours, we're back. I think I have to be nine stars now. Mm. Wow, I found a key. Why was this level updated? It's almost just mid. Some crazy use of breakable objects. What? Why? World's most creatively placed coin. I don't like that. Why did I click the orb? Ah, why is that part so much more difficult? And with that I mean I suck. God, I f hate breakable objects. Okay, cool. That's what it said there. I'm so good at sight reading. Yo! <laughs> wow! Okay, Alphabet M. Let's have an opinion on Alphabet M, shall we? I will be the first person to ever have an opinion on Alphabet M. So Alphabet M, this level is mid as hell. Anyway, don't mind auto base after base being completely invisible. It's better than... No, it's not better than that. Yeah, no, this level kind of sucks. Let's beat Royal Sky. Oh, this was for one of the map packs. Yeah, I don't remember those. No, that's just a motorcycle. That's just somebody who thinks he's a big dick. Don't be 60 only. Okay, cool. Why is it counting down? The time that the motorcycle in the background is just going to finally move away. Whoa! Wow, that actually completely got me. <laughs> I fully fell for that. Okay, that transition is very much of the time. That was kind of okay. It's better than Alphabet M was. I'm bad at video game. Though my life is like a video game trying hard to beat the stage. No, why the f- I just didn't remember that one fake. I'm so f bad. It got me again. <laughs> that full on got me again. That part f My god, I'm so bad. Decently solid level. Royal Sky, there we go. Um, this is like mid beat here. It's a totally level. Good okay, death step. I'm not going to rebeat, so I'm just going to add that to the counter. I have a recording of it, so I will just rank death step where I think it should be, which is not very high. Bottom of B, top of C. I'll put it at the top of C for now. So this is the first little intermission review because I didn't talk about death step pretty much whatsoever when I posted a new funny game journey. Thankfully, you aren't missing much. It's so goddamn mediocre as a club step remake that it just feels like club step from a slightly different alternate universe. The beginning kind of sucks ass, but that's no surprise. It does have some cool parts, but it just leaves no real impression on me. So C tier it is for this one. Let's continue. That was just really mid. Genesis. Oh great, I've heard I've heard stories about this jump. Genesis. I mean that level's good. I think it's very good. That's why he's the goat! Yes, I won the lottery. Don't ruin it. Don't throw away your ticket. Why? It's a good level. I beat them in like th four minutes. I like that a lot. That's a good level. There's a couple of weird spots. But besides that, this level is like a solid A tier. We, yeah, we'll get there. We will. We will get to it. Two more on this page, and both of them are eight stars. Okay, one of them is actually very good. I just don't know about Chrono's Fantasy. <laughs> this is so mid. I'm practicing from one. Hell yeah. Oh, that's a f***ing great transition. I'll beat this. 
Wow, I died there again. <laughs> I died there in practice as well. Chronos Fantasy. Wow, what a Chronos Fantasy level this was. <laughs> um, I think it's probably around here. It's one of one of the better ones I've played so far. Ready for some revolutionary shit? Except V2 was my first ever demon, so look, it's pulsing blocks. What's so cool about that? Well, this was the first level to do it. That that looks like shit. <laughs> Why this part again? This is the third time he did this part. <laughs> so you guys liking it so far? I'm so bad. First person to ever die there, question mark. <sighs> That's a good level. Um, low A tier. It, has sh it does show its age more than Crazy Ball, which is why it's underneath it. Oh, auto electrodynamics. Well, while that's playing, I'm gonna grab a beer. It's just another fucking auto level. Probably good though. I have beer. I'm a legal adult, by the way, don't worry. I already know what this level is like, by the way. That's why I left. I know it's easily his best auto level. Don't know if it cracks A tier, but it's good. I'll just throw it at the top of B tier for now, just to be sure. I do like it more than all of the other ones though. So yeah, so for the only level in D tier, it's very hard, can't let go, which is such a surprise. Also, don't worry, I'm not an alcoholic. I do drink, I'm just not an active drinker. I can't handle shit. So while that, well, that's fizzying up, let's beat Funny Game Holiday. This level doesn't need introduction, let's be honest. It's going in S tier. This is the first S tier. There's no discussion. And that's just because of this part. This is so cool. This is one color channel. I can't believe he made this with one color channel. Especially whilst everybody was still making like basic ass design levels. He was just coming out with this. This part is mid as hell though, but whatever. You kind of need a break for your eyes. I also love how those spikes are synced into the ground. It's just so much about this level I like. Especially that death. Look at those spikes. They're so synced in. I love it. Nobody did that. Yeah, of course, some parts have aged better than others, but whatever. Also, this matches the BPM of the song. I know that's like the bare minimum for an equalizer to do, but who the f*** would think of that? Why? <laughs> Fucking dead face. <laughs> like the video if you're an alcoholic, by the way. Space invaders. Oh, no. Funny game predicted the gauntlets. Yay. More equalizer. This one is actually different. That's so cool. It's more of a flex than anything anyway. Oh yeah, that's getting, that's getting a like. Funny game, holiday, holiday, boom, there you go. What a surprise. Some parts are a bit more uninspired, but it's S tier. It's funny game, holiday. Vector, oh no, wow, that was first take. Even funny game struggles to come up with a good use for the breakable object sometimes. I don't like the gameplay though. It does feel very funny game. Oh, this background is awesome. Wait a second, those are different colors. Oh, he's blending again. God damn it, funny game. Yeah. What? Why am I bad at the game? Okay, cool. I actually almost died to that last UFO like three times. It's a pretty good level. That's about it. Oh god, why is there so many nine stars? Hey, that's that's that was 20. That level was. I already forgot the name. It's like above maximum risk. No, that's above knockout. A and S tier are going to fill up once we get to um, 1.9, I think. Yay, continuing. Forgot to add Genesis, so I did that. Yay. Lonesome. Can't lie, this part is weird. Such a guessing game, what's a hitbox and what isn't. That's not a 9-star ship, though. It's just not. Why does Funny Game use so much f***ing mirror portal? <laughs> Wow, that a flower is color. Wait, that color, that flower had multiple colors. This one's not made in 1.9. You look so mediocre. I mean, 1.8, this is kind of impressive. 1.9, this looks like shit. Bro had four color channels, yet used gray and only gray. Why is that saw blade poking through? This might be our second D tier. <laughs> I died to a shit part in a nine star. Oh, I jumped too early. I'm surprised I survived that long. God! Uh huh. This is high D tier. I didn't like it. I really didn't. Decker wise, it's okay. Gameplay wise, it sucks dick. Checkmate. This all kicks ass. 
It's just made of checkers. Don't remember how it plays. I know I have beaten this before. It's actually a sick ass effect. It's like Funny Game made like all of the okay map pack levels. Also, why is there more mirror gameplay? This all kicks ass. I did 20 nights. <laughs> How is this the same difficulty as the last level? There's no way. I'm so f This part looks so sick. <laughs> Top of B tier. Yeah, well, it's mostly the gameplay, actually. Atlas. Atlas VPN, not the sponsor of today's episode of Dashing with the Bros. Where did the background go? Ooh, this part looks sick. Oh, that's so weird. Yo, it's the crystals that everybody would copy. Yo, swords? Where do I click? I just don't. Dun, 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 dun. No! I mean, that part is kind of f***ing awful, but whatever. That dual ball is f sword. You can tell this is early 1.8 because the f***ing slope usage is so whack. Yay, I beat the easy demon. Okay, easy demon. That took like no time at all. It took less time than the other two. <laughs> 39. Okay, um, so where does it rank? Atlas. Uh, it's worse than this. It's worse than Genesis. It's better than Royal Sky, I think. Yeah, it ranks here. It's a very revolutionary level. I just don't think it aged that well. Another world might be next. Hologram, and then we get into the 1.9 levels, which is where the things really start to rev up. I mean, I think 1.8 is really when Funny Games started to hit home run after home run. Stop with the mirror. No, mirror duel. Mirror asymmetrical duel. Oh, wow. Whoa. <sighs> Ooh, that could, that's, those are, transitions are so clean. God, this part is so weird. <laughs> Not even mad, I'm just very, very concerned for my skill. I just died to that ship. Just doing another goddamn practice run. The nine stars are all harder than the easy demons were. I accidentally pressed the windows key. Oh my god, I'm so... Mm, this is losing me. I actually completely forgot I was in practice mode for a bit there. Oh my god, that shit completely destroys my brain. Either way, I beat it, so... Hologram. That's A tier. I would probably place it right here. This level is really good. It's just that the duels are stupid. Apparently, we're going by steps of two now. Um... We're almost halfway. Well, now we're entering 1.9. Spoiler alert, this one is also going into S tier. <laughs> I don't care how well it plays, this is going into S tier. Like a real, real boundary pusher. I like this. I like this background, wall background. It's just the stars. To the stars. This part is fucking awesome. This part is so cool. I still, like, especially this early in the update, how the f did you think of this? Same goes for this part. Like, like how, how do you think of of effects this f***ing cool and ahead of its time. Like, even Rob don't have to, you know, be touching his fingertips. Like, hey, what's going on? What's he going to make? What's the funny man going to make? I'm very curious. Maybe I'll steal half of his ideas for deadlocks. I'm f <laughs> Jesus, that's bad. <laughs> that was so bad. If this was the nine circles tier list, every single one of Funny Games levels except for Very Hard Godly Go would have gone into A or S tier so far. The best part in the game. Maybe except for the ball that goes right after. Well, no, first you have the rainbow part and then you have the ball. Also, it uses Inferno Plex. I didn't mention that. This, this song gives me positive nightmares, I guess. Can't call them dreams. Just makes me think back at Inferno Plex. Just a lot of mixed feelings, I guess. I also just love how he, he added fill saves. I love that. Yay. One more and then we're at the halfway point. Rainbow Dust is going to be the halfway point. This was Revolution by Funny Game. I mean, this, this is S. I think it's better than Funny Game Holiday. This might not, <laughs> this might just straight up not get topped. So I also just liked how it played. It played very well, very naturally. Actually used the wave in ways you would see today, which is ridiculous, considering how fucking bad people were at wave at the time. It feels like everything just fits together. That's rare. That's very rare. Massive respect. High S tier. Rainbow dust. I know this level's great as well. But now we're just getting into the bangers territory. Yeah, I know this level. This is also early 1.9. Not thinking of aluminum. Oh, that's bad. That's not great. Background is sick. This would be probably be rated an 8 star nowadays, but this level's really good so far as well. Yo, though, that effect of the 
Whoa, we. I forgot this was in here. This guy was so ahead of his time. This is around the time when people barely knew how to make gameplay. I'm just surprised at how well all of these levels have aged. Like playing an old Nintendo game. Just like, it's old, you can tell it's old, but it still just plays so f***ing well. Just like push the boundaries of what's possible, whilst also still just making top-notch stuff. Like look at those pillory multi-block objects, I guess. Most people just use them for generic, like, ground deco. But no, Mr. Funny Game over here has to make them grow with every pulse. Just chill on the ground as much as possible, there you go. Those flowers are also sick as hell, by the way. That's just a gray level once again. Rainbow Dust. We're halfway there, I think. So, where's Rainbow Dust? Um, there it is. Uh, lowest here. <laughs> That's fucking fantastic. That's such a good level. Especially for, like, a non-demon. No, I just... <laughs> oh, I forgot to add the, the auto level, so this is actually 58. Wow, that's annoying. <laughs> That's gonna look so stupid. So yeah, just know it's 58, it's not 54. And yes, I am indeed including Death Moon, which, you know what? I'll just rate that now. I'll just add that to the counter. I don't know when it was released, I think it was later in 1.9. I'll just throw this, yeah, I'll just throw this. It's not better than Revolution. It's second, yeah, it's second, I think so. Everything in S tier is just a masterpiece. I beat that level twice, I think so, yeah. Great level, just has that one UFO that I think bumps it below Revolution. That's the the only complaint, and I had zero complaints for Revolution. Wow, it's a masterpiece! This is the one exception on the list, because this isn't on Funny Games' account. It is fully made by him, though, so I'll discuss it anyway, why not? Yeah, this is one of the most timeless hell levels in this this entire game keep walking it's nothing special the intensity and atmosphere are just so insanely impressive especially for how old this level is this ufo does suck dick to play but that's legit all of the criticisms i have for this level and that's even a bit nitpicky so yeah this is s tier for sure anyway let's just continue to reincarnation that's so cool oh this one it's the one with the candles that have spikes right yeah, those lines, oh my god, they're tripping my eyes. That is such a disorienting effect. <gasps> this level has a parallax effect in 1.9. How? How? <laughs> what the f- Who is this guy? This is the same part again. Okay, that's stupid. I love it. Yeah, this is the exact same part. You know what? F it. You deserve to do that. Okay, so, how? Am I happy I did a practice run of this? I would be so distracted. <laughs> oh, f I just don't want to stop playing. These levels are so fucking good. I have to know how this ball works because it's in the level twice. I did it once, now just for the impossible ship. Words. I mean, this part is something else, man. <laughs> this part is definitely not something else. This is the exact same part. Maybe with the background added? Great level either way, though. Uh, we have another S tier. <laughs> that level's f***ing fantastic. Wow. So where is it? D it's not Don't Cry. Reincarnation. Um, yeah, right there. <laughs> Might even be above Fall Funny Game Holiday. You know what, f*** it. I'm putting it above Funny Game Holiday. I mean, Funny Game Holiday is more in here just because it has to be. This one level I just like a lot. It's just a fan fantastic level. Now we're going on to the one with piano. Does this not have a song? Or is it still downloading? <laughs> Yo, this is sick. This feels so awkward without music. A piano theme level without music is so awkward. The music is just not on Newgrounds, okay? That's so sad, I can't properly rate this. You have this this cool ass panel effect and this 3D looking ass part. That is so cool though, how, do you, how he makes the clothes in. This almost feels lame compared to the others because the others are just that f good. I can't download this song, that's so annoying. Well, we'll just be it without it, I guess. A piano theme level without the song. Yay, there you go, good level. Anyway, La Campanella is um, here. The worst 1.9 level so far. 30. Yeah, I forgot one again. <laughs> well, that's fine. The last level was the halfway point. Now we're over the halfway point. And we're also done with this page. We're almost going into the 2.0 era already. Another world. This looks so trippy. But look, it's one funny game. like, everybody's copying my crystals. So let me improve the ones that I already have made. In fact, let me just have that object added into the game. To make glare effects easier to make. In the gloss tab. Yeah, let me also improve on my equalizer effect. Make it look sick as hell. This guy is just too f with the level editor, man. I don't know what to tell you. Even when you couldn't properly sinks how wait i just realized these objects are basically moving how the hell does he do that i'm so lost <laughs> this little just looks so clean this part is so sick he just revolutionized so much man was bored so he made a moving object god what the f 
fuck, man. I'm speechless. How the fuck do you make this in 1.9? That's there. God damn. It's just so impressive. I mean, so is Death Moon, right? Like, don't get me wrong. They go to Dreamer, Abyss, and then rank those other two. So it's like a BTD5 song. God, this guy. It's just all of his levels go so hard after this point until um, Simplism. Every single one of them goes hard as shit. All of them do. Oh, that's very confusing. That is mean to put in a four star, let little... alone. Yeah, no, that would just be mean in general. It's just such a hard four star. <laughs> that's such a cool level though. Even made the text have a shadow, come on. 32. So yeah, Dreamer, like the lowest of S probably. Yeah, I mean, these are all just levels I don't have anything to say about because they're just that impressive and ahead of their time. I don't want to ruin them. This is his last one. No, this is his first 2.0 level. We just got out of the, the golden age of funny game. Now we're heading into the level that added the first low detail mode ever. And this level will show you that not even funny game had a perfect transition into 2.0. Don't get me wrong. He had a way better one than most did. But like, yeah, no, parts like this just... They have aged. <laughs> What the f- Just feel like you don't have to do nearly as much visual storytelling. Now that there's, you know, yeah, text objects and shit like that. And I just liked his visual storytelling so much. Now he can credit himself. Map by funny game, guys. Yes, this is in 2.0. He still called levels maps. Huh? You know, that part is weird. So is this one. At least he added exclamation points as to when to click. Kinda cool. Could've also just showed me where to click. Man had a stroke and stopped creating. The end. Comma, comma, comma. To be continue. Not continued. Continue. Yeah, this, um, this is not great. <laughs> Especially after blazing through all of his masterpieces he made in 1.9. Like, this is so much worse than anything he made in 1.9. Well, because you gave him more options, he just made a mess as his first level. <laughs> That ball's so bad. <laughs> I mean, this guy, guy didn't use cliches, he created them. Yeah, this didn't age well. <laughs> to be continued. God, I hope not. Just dated, that's the... Yeah, that's the best way I can describe it, it's dated. So yeah, I will add Abyss, which 33, and I've already been Serious, which will be 34, and Lonely Travel, which will be 35. So I will add until 35. You'll hear my more in-depth thoughts about the demons as well, but for now, Abyss is like, um, it did add the low detail mode though, so I can't put it below auto club stuff. It's like in the middle of the auto levels. It's not a terrible level, especially not for the time period it came out in, but still. Um, where the fuck did I add? Did I literally forget to add Sirius? <laughs> I did. I made a thingy for it. Yeah, I did. I just didn't add it. So yeah, no, Sirius. There you go. Where in S tier shall I put this? This is a very good level. Probably around... I would place it here. I mean, it's like the first proper custom boss fight level. And it plays, so that's special. The first major boss fight level. Though the gameplay sure is rough at places, and grinding this from zero can become a drag due to how slow and boring the beginning is, Sirius is such an important level, and decoration-wise, it has actually aged remarkably well. It's intense as hell once again, similarly to Death Moon, and the backgrounds are so insanely ahead of their time that it makes the rest of the levels around it feel like cave paintings. So yeah, just like Death Moon, this is going in S tier. I don't care what anybody has to say. Lonely travel, high A tier. It's it's just very boring, that's it. It's insanely influential, but I don't think the influence was particularly um, good in hindsight, but still. It's like the it was a little longest level in the game back then. It does storytelling, you know, visual storytelling very well, so yeah. Here we have visual storytelling at its absolute peak. It's so simple, so strong, yet it doesn't feel forced or like a gimmick in any way, shape, or form. The impact this level had is also similar to Sirius, being the first ridiculously long level to actually be worth a shit. It starts out black and white, then slowly gets more and more color as the music crescendos. And though the gameplay is insanely boring and very unbalanced, that doesn't remove the impact and sheer girth of this walk in the park. A tier for this one. Also, yes, I did miss another <laughs> level on the couch there. So it's now 59. <laughs> Shut up. I can count. Here we go. Funny game time. Let's beat some more funny game. Funny game. Yeah. Funny. Uh huh. Gay. Okay. Wow, we have a double trouble over here because first I'm beating Don't Cry and then I'll add puzzle trials as well. Yay, because I'm not rebeating an insane fing demon. Yo, the quest with the Kim Jong un face. Oh, wow. I did not catch those things being the hitboxes. I remember this level being. Why am I in practice mode? It's a four star. Oh, that's why. It's a bad. Badly made four star. This is the first GD I've played today, so I might suck all mega balls. 
I missed a coin. Now I'm going to cry. But don't cry because that's what the level's called. Despite the level, I'm going to cry. <laughs> If I'm going to die, I am going to cry. Eventually. Alone. Oh no. Lonesome. That's the same word. Quiet. That's not the same word, but the same implication. Sad. That's better. Well, <laughs> it's not better. I feel it all. Poor guy. Oh no. Don't be depressed. You have talent. Don't be depressed. If you don't have talent, also don't be depressed. Yeah, don't cry. By Jay Dilla. Whoa, I'm Butterfly. Whoa, this is a tough ass four star. Jesus. Well, I don't know if you can touch the floor, the ceiling. Aurora Borealis. What? What indication did I have that those things were going to kill me in a 4 star or 5 star, whatever this is? This is a tough ass heart rate level, especially for 2.0. Oh yeah, wait, this was made in 2.0. That's actually sick. I don't see janky spider gameplay yet, so I guess it's made in 2.0. Also, no uh, finger dash inspirations. Because see funny game just coming back and making like a 3D realistic art level. Or he's going to make something very abstract. I'm not going to turn on hitboxes. That's cheating, especially in the middle of such a difficult level. But I'm very curious if this ground or ceiling kills you but i'm not gonna test it okay good to know that those things kill you for some reason why why is the ground deadly oh my god this is such an early 2.0 level in gameplay i would be very emotional if the gameplay didn't suck dick i'm just emotional because i'm mad at the gameplay so yeah no this is never gonna be s tier it looks great the vibe is great the gameplay is very unsight readable though and if decoration comes at the cost of gameplay usually i can overlook it but not for a five star i've seen people play gd like right in front of me just random two and three and four stars and they will just quit after two attempts if they they can't beat a level so i guess i'm judging easier levels by that metric now because i've literally seen what happens live in front of me without my input it's like setting up a thought experiment but we're not setting it up wow okay i missed the button and then i got killed by the floor spikes that are invisible yeah um i mean the candle effect is sick as hell just most of the decoration in this level is so good it's also so varied and you know what's also very terrible the gameplay wow although i'm not bored yet which is an achievement you have to make some pretty engaging four star gameplay for me to not get bored he feels it all what <laughs> Wait. <laughs> this is the best coin I've ever gotten in the game. Caught me out so hard there. So yeah, you have to laugh at his ass to get a coin. Wow, what a good coin. So yeah, the ground kills you even though there's no indication that it does. Wow, and I spent like five minutes of my life on that. It's actually a very sweet end screen though, especially for Feta to 2.0 level. I do like it. It just pl it plays like absolute dog shit. So yeah, I'm going to bump it to 37. Wow. What a bonus for me beating one of his harder levels. I know that Proxima is up soon. God damn it, that's gonna be difficult. But for now, don't cry. Um, Top of B tier. I don't think it's as good as Checkmate. It goes here. The gameplay ruins it. The decoration is high A tier. The gameplay is low C to high D tier. And in a level this easy, it should be just playable. And it's just very annoying. Puzzle Trials, low S tier. It's such a cool level. The concept just kicks ass. It's also very enjoyable, at least in my opinion. Though it's ridiculously balanced around the... Uh, the the, the Q parts, which is pretty annoying, but still. Great level. Really like. Here we go. This level is my jam. Puzzle Trials is one of the most iconic and creative memory levels in the game. There are so many cool ideas presented here and so many cool parts and gimmicks that it feels like a flex. Though the gameplay is really unbalanced and based on the middle cube parts, that doesn't take away from the Minesweeper part or the UFO part that remembers where you've been. Just the sheer creativity and inventiveness carries this level to S tier for me. What a masterpiece. Okay. Now the last regular funny game level for new game or something like that? The new funny game comes in this is his last the last level that he says he had influence over and that we know he had influence over you kind of feel it by the gameplay this is definitely not his gameplay i just straight up wouldn't believe that it feels so not like funny game gameplay this is a bit more like it yeah no this is the last of a platinum age basically of funny game and of gd levels that's so, that's fucking awful. That's so evil. Creators, don't do that. I think it was with Lucia Chick, right? This part is so cool. This is why I know that he can... I just did the two-frame wall jump. This feels much more like an easy demon than all of his easy demons did. Also, I don't know what his what, uh, funny game's pronouns are. I just assume it's him. Might be just an asshole, though. <laughs> Whoa, we is actually tripping my eyes right the fuck out. All pink is block. You can land on all pink. Yeah, it is Lucia Chick, okay. Lucia Chick is definitely a she because... Check.
What? That gameplay sucks. Some of the parts in this level look so crummy, so raw. Then you have that one 3D looking part, which is just like the purest form of fire you will ever see in the ocean. That part is so bad. Why? Who does that? Probably Loser Chick. That's not something that Funny Game, I feel like, would do. Not saying that Loser Chick's parts are bad. They are not. They are really good. But the gameplay leaves a lot to be desired, so to speak. Let's go low. Why? 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 The spiral thing, the thing that, like, notifies you if it's a good path. So I just noticed that. Either way, that's a pretty weird, stupid design decision. Just add an arrow. Not that difficult. You added so many arrows here. Why were you hesitant there? Here, they don't even point to anything. Yeah, no, the moving object parts are shit. They are quite shit. I don't like them. To play, at least. They look kind of cool, I guess. Whoa-wee. That's a very trippy transition. Even for funny game standards. Well, I assume this is still loser chip. I think this is where funny games part starts. I don't know why. What? Bad gameplay. <laughs> this level is just as bad of gameplay as uh, Don't Cry. And I just assumed that around this time, Funny Game was learning his friend how to use, how to make levels like him, so that it didn't look like he dipped. Why is this part so slow? I will never understand why this part is so slow. Just speed it up. This is, yeah. I'm fully convinced that the second half is Funny Games half. I mean, it's not terrible. It's just not, it's just not how I would design a level, I guess. Well, that's original Funny Games entire level catalog. Every single one of them. I didn't skip one, but there's still a lot of other stuff to go. I mean, this level's still good, don't get me wrong. It pills in comparison to some of his peaks. It's very inconsistent, but that's mostly because of Loser Chicks um, parts. I think, yeah, I think that Funny Games parts are like high A, and I think Loser Chicks part are like mid C Funny Game standards. So I'll just toss it above Atlas, below Genesis. Now, Ah, you know what? No, it's better than Abyss. Who the f*** am I kidding? It's here. It's definitely better than Abyss. I don't think it's better than some of his best autos, though. His best autos are very good. Either way, this is where new funny game starts, I think. Yeah, funny game's back. Yeah, no, this is definitely where the uh, where the creator point switched hands, I guess. I mean, this level still looks sick. It's not that new funny game is a bad creator. <laughs> Absolutely not. Just not nearly as revolutionary as the original. Yeah, you can tell by the gameplay. This is so different. This feels so much worse to play. Why is there a gravity portal? This is super obviously just a completely different person now. Gameplay wise, yeah, no, that is um not subtle at all. It went from somebody who has played since the first f***ing update to somebody who just started playing and gameplay wise you can really you you feel that I and mean, it's still relatively good for the time it's just it's like 6.5 out of 10 gameplay compared to like 95 out of 100 right it's just old funny games gameplay was so stupidly smooth or original funny game and i want to say old funny game sounds like he's f***ing dead so yeah a couple of very weird site readability issues a couple of parts look like not good they look like not good good job me i do really like those particles being sucked in Faster and faster, though. That's a cool effect. But like, fucking hell. It's so obvious. <laughs> Believe me. <laughs> like, why is there a gravity portal in there? It's so poorly made. Can you touch the ceiling? Okay, at least that's something that <laughs> he improved. You can touch the ceiling and the ground without you dying for no reason. That was actually the one thing that Funny Game really had a lot of, especially his later work. I mean, that does make this some of the most boring nine-star gameplay I've ever played through. Wow, um, it's going to do another practice run. I mean, to be fair, I also had to do that for some of the older levels, but still. Why is there a gravity portal in there? Why is there one in this one? It's just such shit design. There's no other way to put it. It's just bad design because you could have just kept the gameplay fine if you just didn't make it fucking invisible. Same goes for that dual portal. Why is there a dual portal there? This part also looks weird. Yeah, a lot of gameplay complaints. That's not just the gameplay isn't good. It's just poorly designed places. To be fair, this entire part actually plays totally fine. It's just a bit sloppy. Wow, I can so totally read that. What is happening? It's a blessing that I actually know how to play this game. Christ, this gameplay. It's also just so exhaustingly boring because the beginning is just this. I get why not many people have actually fully beaten this because this is exhausting. <laughs> yes, this is 2.1 because Dash Orbs and Spiders. This is definitely the logical stepping over points to the new funny game. This is a pretty cool effect, can't I lie. God, just I hate the gameplay in this level. I said it was like a 6.5. No, this is more like a 4 to a 3.5 maybe even. Like, spoiler alert, this isn't going to rank that high. This is easily the roughest level in this entire catalog so far. I don't think it's F tier because it looks cool. I don't even know if there's going to be any more D tiers. <laughs> that f***ing transition. Who the f*** makes shit like that? Right, I'm just getting mad.
Why the f shit like this just makes me so mad. I'm so bad with levels like this. They're just poorly made. Basically, I think a lot of easier levels are very frustrating to die on because there will just be one part that sucks ass. You'll just get to that part every single attempt and then die to that shit every single attempt. It's so frustrating, so annoying. That's what happens a lot. And otherwise, the level's just so exhaustingly boring that I just don't, don't want to play it. That's why I don't star grind anymore. There's no good star grinding levels, really. I think this level proves it. Wow, I almost died so many times at that ending. Yeah, I hate I hate the gameplay in this. The gameplay in this is so bad. Anyway, that's another page done. I think it's two pages left now. Just really, really... I had the entire month planned for this and it's only October 4th. So, um... But I think 2 by 2 is going to release probably October 22nd if I had to guess. So, most time will just be spent editing this. Nova, um... Yeah, that's going in C tier. I probably have until then. Better than... I don't think it's better than Death Step, which is <laughs> pretty sad. But that's mostly... that. No, that's not mostly. That's just just because of the gameplay. The gameplay is just so ass. It's it's so bad. Looks kind of cool though. Oh great. <laughs> oh no. Okay, we have hit the first roadblock of a couple. You can see that new funny game likes demons a lot more than old funny game. There's two insane demons in here and also random ass heart demon. Yeah, no, I don't think the medium demons will be a roadblock, but I can already see the first roadblock. Yo, this plays okay. Ow, my eyes. Whoa. Whoa, we mate. Um, next time maybe balance your level. I can. <laughs> I have to learn this. Just so much off-screen garbage. And why does it lag? I didn't mention it, but none of Funny Game older levels lagged like whatsoever. This already lags more than any level of his has lagged combined. This is the type of level that would make me quit a series. By the way, this is the type of level. Yo, this boss is actually awesome though. I can shit on this level all I want. This boss is kind of sick. What? What the f am I dying to? Oh wow, that's so clear. Okay, you. Can hug the ceiling. Great. I'll just chill on the bottom. That works. <laughs> then go up, down, I guess. Yeah. Then go up. No. I definitely have to practice that one again. What? There's another fucking boss fight. Did it say Hitler click? Wow. I didn't. <laughs> so you start by hugging the ceiling. Then you hug the bottom for two attacks. No, for one attack. God, I fucking hate learning to by no boss fights. Hug the ceiling, then hug the ceiling again. Just all of the epicness goes away once you realize that it's just going to be a memory challenge and that you don't know what f hits you. Like, give me indicators. Where the f I have to go? This is a bottom attack, yeah. And that's the first boss? No. He has those two claw attacks. That's it. Okay, there are indicators at this part. Oh, you actually do have to hit spam, okay. Wait, so it gives you like a small indicator, like the red beam thing. The attack itself is so much bigger than the indicator. I hope this is enough. I'm double butterflying right now. Yes, that's how I do most spam parts. I'm pretty decent at doing double butterflies. <laughs> Let's do the entire boss in one go. This is usually not how I learn medium demons, by the way. This is just a specifically terribly learny level. There's actually a very easy boss fight once you know how it works. Just very, 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 very poorly indicated. But it's memory based. And then hit or click. Okay, it doesn't say hit. Like 47 to 100. I think this was supposed to be a hard demon. Like all of the signs point to me thinking that this was supposed to be a hard demon. Jesus Christ, words. I'm not a native speaker, okay? Let me be, okay? That wave is so hard. Like, that wave is so difficult for a medium demon. This has to be one of the hardest medium demons I've ever played. This is so difficult for a medium demon. So free. No, stay up, dumbass. Down. Stay down for two attacks. Do this first claw swipe and then go up. Stay up. I think, yeah, that doesn't matter anyway. Me trying to craft the perfect symphony of the worst sound you've ever heard in your entire life. <laughs> F Yo! Falling out of the world. And that flashing effect is awful. Just like, why is that wave so hard? Like, that feels like it could fit an AQ. Not deco wise, but gameplay difficulty wise. Absolutely. Like, Sir Punch early 2.0 balancing. It's just all of the difficulties just put into one wave or one ship part. That is whack as hell. Anyway, but the decoration, yeah, it's cool, but like, it's funny game. Either version of funny game just makes great looking decoration. After this, I've Proxima. F That's a hell level. Once again, something that funny game never used to do. He didn't care. He set the trends. He didn't have to follow them. Why is the gameplay so shit? Yeah, no, this um, new funny game, new game really had a lot to live up to, and he didn't live up to it in the gameplay department and in the um, flashing lights department, I guess. This might actually genuinely be a B tier. Leaves a sour taste in your mouth every single day, time you die to that stupid ass wave. Oh my god! It's so bad. It's just so many questions I have. I, I legit look away at that flashing part, by the way. I just can't look at it. God! It's so 
so awkward. Wow, why would you add that? There's so many things. Just like Zoink buff this level. What a good joke. I ain't stopping. Cool. Very bad. I fluked that from 25 or so, right? <laughs> yeah, from 25. That's our demon. That's stupid. What do you mean five? I mean, just looking at my attempts, I can't really defy giving this. To be fair, like, just the first 25% is very difficult. The rest is actually not that bad. It's just, I don't know, man. Like, genuinely E tier gameplay. I never expected to say that. Maybe I'm just being persuaded, but now that I think about it, like, <laughs> I'm the 200th. I'm the last one on the leaderboard. God, I need to get leaderboard on band, I guess. Prox, I'm gonna do one practice run and then I'm gonna go for now. I'll learn this. I'll probably first cut down a lot of the recordings because I don't have much space left. Oh, just great. These things, why? <laughs> no, man. Why is there a block here? Hey, what the? Why? Oh, great. This part doesn't lag at all. This boss, this is actually a cool ass part though. I don't know where I have to go. That's bad. You can die in that transition at only specific times. Yeah, of course, because that's what I guessed would happen. Those are tight. I know there's another weird boss with weird looking attacks. Why is it off scene? Got this place like ass. Like, I get why people found out this, that this isn't the same guy. Wow, this attack is so bad. It's also super laggy. Oh, that's that's so good. Oh, that's also just just mwah. you know I I'm gonna I'm gonna hate this level. There's only 15 victors. It's a funny game level. So yeah, I wanna load in the LDM. It's gonna be what I'm gonna be having to gonna be for the gonna be, and I'm gonna be gonna be gonna be. <sighs> Why do I have to talk about this level? This is the worst level I've ever beaten. Bar none, somehow. Let me show you why. So first of all, this level doesn't run. Like most new funny game levels, but this one especially. It barely walks, it just limps behind your frame rate constantly. Besides regular level creation issues, we have the gameplay. I'll walk you through every single part and tell you why it's a crime against humanity and should be put into the negative section of the Geneva Convention. Starting with the best and worst part. This first ship is so fucking easy. It's so easy that this makes the entire rest of the level just so much worse in comparison. Like imagine grinding the worst demon ever from zero but having to sit through this ship every single attempt. Believe me, it gets boring very quickly. Still in comparison to all of these other parts, this part being boring is a blessing in disguise. Right after, we have this insanely awkward transition into the most awkward wave you will ever play. This part just does not ever get consistent. Like, look at this last bit. You can die here from entering the invisible teleport portal facing downward, which is a bug that is ridiculously common in this part because you don't know when you're going to transition. Also, it's spammy as hell, which means you will be tired before getting into the next part of the wave. Yes, there is another part of the wave. No, I am not lying. Entering this part, only this first structure has D blocks on it that make you slight, like I showed off in my live reaction. This wouldn't be an issue if there weren't bastard spikes poking out, Plus these saw blades that force you to spam in like a very specific type of shitty pattern. And yes, we are still in the pre-drop as we enter the hardest part of the level gameplay wise. So after becoming suicidal and having your wrist in pain, you get into this extremely tight mini wave section that will eat up around half your attempts if you actually manage to make it past the beginning. And yes, that invisible block that I showed off in my live reaction actually is an enormous pain in the ass because it makes this click, which was already annoying and all almost blind, complete bullshit. And this not seeing issue is extremely, extremely common as well. Almost every single click has like either a completely blind click or release. So this part just becomes 100% muscle memory. And considering how hard it is, that is just not an option most of the time. So get your Bibles out and pray. And this is just the f***ing pre-drop. We are finally entering the first boss fight. The first part of the boss fight is purely based on if you know where the hell you can go and where you can't go during certain parts of the boss. Also, this structure kills you, which means that around half of the time you will die to something you can barely f see. And yes, it's consistently in your way. It is very, very annoying. Oh yeah, and don't worry if your wrist was somehow still alive. This is more f wave spam because why not? That is called gameplay, guys. Learn it! Then after spamming through these round motherfuckers, you get into the only somewhat playable part of the level, as the second half of the boss fight feels the most fair out of any of the BS in this level. You can still die from the guy twerking you to death, though, so do keep that in mind. This is like seeing a beautiful flower in the middle of the most enormously bloody car crash imaginable. Now for this small little interlude section that seems okay at first, until you realize that all of the clicks have dependent timings, and you can die 
I? Like this on the spider. Wow, how quirky. I know it's not funny games fault that this happens, but come on. You died to this literally two out of three times. This is such an enormous choke point. It's absolutely stupid. Stupid. Don't worry, there is something I can blame Funny Game for, which is making the gravity portals invisible. Just make them visible! Such an easy fix, it is literally less effort to fix it. I hate this. After you get through three of the clicks of hell, you get into the second boss fight. If you somehow got here completely sane, you will still exit completely insane because these attacks are some of the most awkward, annoying bullshit I've ever had to deal with. For the first one, you just kind of have to wing it and hope you don't die. The second one speaks for itself. And the third one is really just the icing on top of the cake of this entire level. A classic, what can I die to section. Great, I love that. The only thing that stays consistent in this entire part is that the top will kill you. Which, don't worry, is very, very, very bad. Look at how you exit this. You realize how easy it is to accidentally bop the spike up here. Thankfully, I didn't, but oh my god. Oh yeah, and don't forget to spam at the end, because if you don't, you will die to the floor like I showed you. So I hope that explains why this lands at a 0 out of 100 enjoyment rating for me. Doing all of this in a row with the lag and not falling asleep is such an insane mental and physical challenge that I would recommend no one try this. No one try to beat all funny game levels. This level just own is already enough to push everybody away from ever trying this. Let's get back to the action before I explode. Finally, I can move on. Good lord, Proxima is so f***ing bad. I don't know when this will come out, but I assume that Proxima is going to stay the worst level. Full stop. <laughs> Not just in this series. It's the worst level I've ever beaten. It is my least favorite. It is so bad. The, uh, the poor before this probably explained that though so you wouldn't be surprised okay so where in the tier list is it going i'm adding a new row below that is going to be um no and i'm going to put proxima in that no tier um and move on with my life because this no i'm just kidding i'm just gonna call it like F. This is F. This is so shit. You know what? F I'll make it gray just to make sure. F. This is this is its own tier. The level looks alright, but you can't run it. You can't even run the LDM properly. I was dropping to 100 frames on the LDM. Like, that's bad. I can dock a lot of points for that, but the gameplay? Oh my god. Wow, that's impressively bad. Also, yes, I do now play on the Seo device because it's a good device to play GD. I really like it. And it has a Nyan Cat Idol animation. How are you going to hate on an idle animation like that? Okay, Deadly Storm. It's a seven star, but it's a new funny game. Seven stars, so it's probably going to be bad to play. Wow, this looks weird. Oh, I love that gameplay. That's so fun. I hate new funny games gameplay. This part looks sick. <laughs> oh, wait, there's a coin up there. That's a very easy coin. Dun, 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 dun. Can you slide? Of course. No, why am I asking? It's new funny game. Of course you can't slide. What difficulty is this level again? How do you go from like one of the best gameplay creators ever to this shit? It's not as bad as Proxima, but nothing is as bad. Bad as Proxima. I mean, this level is at least cool looking. The gameplay leaves a lot to be desired once again. You can just smell when this was made. I mean, this part looks sick. I really like how this part feels. That's such a... Ch wow, I'm so bad. I just beat Proxima. Come on, man. Proxima is like the worst wave gameplay I have ever ever touched this comes from me the bad levels guy don't play proxima don't play proxima what why is the decoration all of a sudden here <laughs> wait that's so weird that background is fucking awesome though i love that background i also love this i don't love the fact that this is the part that drops me to 80 frames why is it so laggy it feels like new nintendo versus old nintendo really old funny game had like top tier optimization this guy just he just doesn't have optimization skills really I don't know why the backgrounds were gone those first attempts, but I beat it with all of the decoration. I actually really like that level besides the gameplay. I'm gonna give it a like. I know, right? The 51st victor with all three coins. That's so stupid. Oh, touch when you start. Oh, yeah. my These keys are so, so... They are so trigger sensitive. Yeah, okay. That's 41. Now we have more demon gameplay. I'm so not looking forward to the demons. You don't even want to know. Magic 2 album review. Shut up. Okay, Deadly Storm. Um, I like it. I think it's a good level. I'll put it here. It's in, uh, yeah, higher B tier. The gameplay is bad. The decoration is excellent. I actually really like how it looks. The optimization is bad, but I just beat Proxima. My 
standards are low, okay? Cut her knife. Cut her knife with cord cutter by Boom Kitty. Oh, I got free Kim Jong Un's. That's already a bad transition. That's why are those blocks spikes? You have to do a wall click, <laughs> guys. This is a bad sign. Oh, you can actually touch the floor for once. Oh, this is cool. I like the vibe. Why does the ground kill you in the ceiling? This is a. S oh wait, no, this is a medium demon actually. Oh my god. Ow, my eyes. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> why are these blocks so empty? Jesus Christ, that wave's hard. So this... I don't know. <laughs> At least it's original gameplay, I guess. <laughs> Why does that happen? <laughs> That's so stupid. Just like always, new funny game doesn't know how to make wave gameplay. So yes, if you're playing a new funny game level um, and it has the wave in it, just leave. Not even in Deadly Storm. It was one good wave part. The other wave part was god-awful. <laughs> Yeah, no, this part is super awkward. I actually really like the deco in this first part, though. I don't mind looking at this every single attempt. Same goes for this part. This part looks cool. It just looks so over the top. I kind of like. Oh, wow. I just realized what my frames are dropping to. Oh, my God. This level's so laggy. Yes, I am playing this on 360. Oh, my God. What the? F I was just taking the biggest swag rats ever. This level just feels extra, and I kind of like it. I don't like the gameplay. Wait, what? I pressed F1. How to get help in Windows? What the f are you talking about? I don't care. Just wanted to go into practice mode. <laughs> I actually did want to get help during um, my Proxima sessions, though. That level took me 10 days. I beat an extreme in the meantime because I hated the level so much. And I learned another one. And both of them are better, even though they are, like, two of the stupidest extremes in the game. I don't know why I do that swag route. Wait, is this fireballs? Why? That's so laggy. <laughs> like, I can be almost 100% sure that Funny Game hacks most of his completions now. Or hacks most of his levels. Or lets somebody else verify it and not change anything. Why is there a slope here? I mean, that's helpful, but... But it's funny game. Just make your gameplay better. At least he learned from um, the mistakes he made in Proxima. Oh, I have friends. Good job, me. Alting the Heimer. Helping the Heimer. <laughs> My funniest joke. <laughs> Opening the Heimer. Dude, even Eker Hacker version 2 has better optimization than this shit. I remember this was actually one of the first medium demons I tried to play and I just quit after like 6%. <laughs> yeah, I think I got to this way and was like, f*** this. I'm not doing this. <laughs> Boy, I wish I could. Swag route, let's go. At least this is really preparing me for Two-Faced Agony, I guess. Like, Two-Faced Agony, I don't care how bad this is, not because I've heard some very mixed opinions. We'll see. I'm nervous. Why the f- What the f- Make gameplay that functions. Why is every new funny game just the worst thing I've ever played? Like, come on. Mom, look, I made my first 2.1 gameplay. What? Me when funny game gameplay. I know I've been dogging on his gameplay a lot, but like, at times I really can't do much else. Like, a part like this, this looks cool and all. Playing this doesn't feel cool. I just, yeah, I just feel like it's so poorly playtested. I'd be surprised if he even playtested it. Wait, there's no hitbox. <laughs> That's really funny. Wow! I never did that, come on. 60 hours gaming. Oh, you flip there if you hold. Oh, that's so cool. Wow. Been on this level so long. Just beat it. I just can't stand wave spam anymore. Funny games levels are just so much wave spam. Yay. That is really annoying. <laughs> That's really, really annoying. Cut or Kniff, how many attempts? 250, exactly. That's a beautiful count. I do agree that's a lower end medium demon. I still did like it. <laughs> still say it has terrible gameplay. Spam, wave, um, lag. In the tier list, this goes into C tier. Deco wise, it's cool, but gameplay wise, this goes for so many funny game levels. Just, yeah, I just, I can't, I can't man. No! <laughs> Did I, I didn't change the counter. Um, the song is on. It's just really quiet. Oh, that's so cool. That's such good gameplay. God, this part is so much louder. What is this shit? Funny game. Learn how to make gameplay. Mm-hmm. I'm not doing this right now. I can't. I just can't be bothered. Blim, blim. Why the f the screen frozen? Let's go. Mountain. Mountain, mountain, mountain king. Mountain king, mountain king. Mountain, 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 mountain king. This all is bad, by the way. Don't play it. I know, what a surprise. It's another f new funny game gameplay demon. 
Aha, uh -huh, swag rod, let's go. Ooh, whoa, whoa, I'm so gamer. Wow, I skipped the dash up, guys. My dick just grew two sizes. Whoa, the wave. The only hard part of this entire level is the ship. The um, 60 billion times speed ship. Specifically, the dual part sucks ass. Jump, 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 jump. Oh, and this part's also f***ing annoying. Hey, I actually got past it. Okay, ship time, hopefully. Ah, uh, this is not the thing you want to be playing in the morning, by the way. This is so f***ing boring. The music is so quiet. <laughs> the Mountain King section will either be 10 minutes or 10 seconds, depending on how much I have to, to say. This level generates some views. Whoa, do you hear that? Me neither, because the music is so f***ing quiet. GD invented Beethoven. It's all so boring, because it's just a 50 simulator. I Meaning it is black and white, so that makes sense. I am such a funny haha -ha man. Yay! I've already practiced that ship. It's just not a fun. This this all is just not good. I like how over the top it goes, but it's not fun to play. Don't play this as your first medium demon, by the way. Absolutely don't. Never. So this part is okay. This is not the real issue. It's this next part. What a bad level. <laughs> Yay! Wow. You would let me wait that long just to die to that jump. Yay! This level has to suck ass. Hard wave? No. No! It's so boring and then you get to the one part that's kind of difficult and it's just the worst shit you've ever seen. Great. Makes me want to commit eye socket murder. Time for... Just got kicked out. The game's like, no! Pick up the SEO device because I'm a dry heart pro. I've beaten like one actual heart level on a SEO device so far and it's f***ing Proxima, which is my least favorite level I've ever beaten. Ooh, I have are freezing why the hell did I let go you can die to that okay notes to self don't how is this a medium demon by the way this is so difficult to sit through wow that's so cool that that can happen wow that's awesome dude my best is dying there exactly there but this part isn't aligned properly so I have to hug like come on dude it's not a skill issue it's literally just not aligned properly what the fuck am I supposed to do then also thanks to Zeronium for the tip of looking at the um, upside down dual ship because reverse gravity and dual ship have the same physics for some reason God, this level is so bad. I'm playing Proxima 2 Electric Boogaloo. You know, I'm more bored playing this than that. It's just so boring. I have nothing to say. This level generates views, I guess. That's it. All funny game levels to be popular. Why is it this one? Cool. So cool. F off. God damn it. God. Oh my god! Make gameplay that functions! Like, I'm- Why is that gap even that tight to begin with? Oh my god! Oh my god, so I've been playing this for 25 minutes, I've barely gone anywhere. Yay, that's another minute of my life I will never get back. Absolute dog shit. So bad. For a medium demon. 630th and for a f***ing medium demon. I hate that level. That is- Wow, he's on a bad track record. New funny game. I enjoyed the flawless more than his first three demons combined. Come on, man. That's the flawless. That's like no competition. Jeez, that level so bad. What happened? Like genuinely, how did it go this downhill this fast? Oh great, another- This one is actually XL. Why? Okay, this is playable so far. Okay, it's already laggy. That's so tight. This is an XL medium demon. Yes, all of those sparks are real, which means that this part is going to be extremely f***ing annoying. Well, what the hell? <laughs> this is cool. You die to this lava wall? Please don't say you can die to the lava wall. Okay, cool, you can't. Why is there one spot? Why are there spikes in that thing. I do actually really like how accurate the hitbox are for these. They don't feel bullshit. The, the, the lava walls, those feel bullshit. Wow, this part looks so wacky. Oh, that's so cool. You didn't... Wow, that's buggy. Oh, just f***ing great. Play test your shit. What the hell do I have to do here? Oh, that's such a cool way to kill somebody. Of course, there's spam. You can't have a new funny game level without spam. Oh, a boss fight. Oh, that's such a cool thing to put at the end of your level. What the hell? Why does that hit you? Oh, cool invisible speed portals. I mean, it's better than Proxima. Oh, wait. I have to update the counter because I beat Mountain King. Like, why are those sparks there? Like, that part doesn't work. It just... These nuts. 
Space UK looking ass. Oh, that's so cool. Like, man. Why does that thing need to have a hit? What a useless LDM. <laughs> it just removes hitboxes. It just makes this part easier. Huh? Huh? Did he not remove the hitboxes? No. Did he remove the decoration but not the hitboxes? I'm going to laugh my ass off if that's true. <laughs> <laughs> not even mad that's so funny <laughs> but why that's so bad what the f is that shit it usually turns around but now it's just stuck to the floor <laughs> oh that's so good the guy really didn't play test at all it was just no play testing like the worst play test level i've ever seen but yeah now i'm still beating this in ldm why are these normal blue orbs and then these are like cobwebby things also that part barely works like this ball part is very fun i really like the ball part then you have the world's worst ship transition also when the f is he going to learn how to optimize jesus christ he's just removing obstacles why is this level so nerfed <laughs> we're playing on the ldm me for people who say that Playing on an LDM is not the correct way to play level. Go f yourself. If the level's easier on the LDM, play it on the LDM. Why would you handicap yourself like that? That's so stupid. This level's just nerfed on the LDM. I'm playing it on the LDM. I don't care. Like, it's strictly nerfed, except for one tiny gap. That is ridiculous. <laughs> How does this part lag still? At least the most annoying part's now sight readable, I guess. I love the fact that you can see when you transition. It's so cool. Like, I'm dying to f I hate that shit so bad. Thankfully, it is very funny, but I don't think it's going to be funny if I keep dying to it. All the funny games and medium demons just feel like nerfed hard demons or nerfed insane demons. Wow, did you, did you look at that? I missed the invisible hitboxes there. God, that jump is so shit. If I died to that in an extreme, I would be mad, but because it's easier compared to the rest. Now I'm just mad because it's stupid. Just love that it's an LDM and it barely removes anything except for that enormous firewall that just strictly makes that part way easier. What? Why the hell did I even click? At least I'm having more fun with this than I did with <laughs> Proxima and with um, Mountain King. So this level is at least funny bad instead of just awful. Stop being f like I have to spend a minute of my life that I could also spend on masturbating on that shit Yes, this is the type of gameplay that I really can't stand Like I have gotten the question multiple times of what is like some gameplay you can't stand because I really do enjoy a lot of shit levels Well, this is the type of gameplay I can't stand it's just finicky awkward garbage But that's not really bad because it's objectively bad gameplay or like stupid gameplay It's just because of bad hitboxes or very poorly playtested stuff just like if you make the most awkward thing ever but you've playtested it properly or even if you haven't and it just happens to work it's just this is just in the uncanny valley of awkwardness i'm already getting so bored why is this level even excel in the first place and this is somehow with that shit in here it's still easier on the ldm this definitely was not playtested on the ldm you would have come across that right away at least i kind of like this song i guess parts of it maybe i like what this level is going for at least just more than i can say about the other two i just i just beat about mountain king or proxima i like that part this part is actually so freaky to the eyes this is so weird i've seen this bug before so i'm just spamming i'm spamming low though i'm around here i think God, that f you can't dodge that shit. It's so bad. Look at this thing. Like this entire black part and red part is a full hitbox. Like why would you make that? Okay, still same day. It's like an hour later. I really do want to just quickly finish this off. Wow, I'm already rusty. <laughs> Skilled by the issue. Ooh, poopa stinker. Wow. Yeah, fuck that part. Why the hell did I go down? I mean, if you make something like that, that's just bad. It's not play tested, or it's intentionally bad, which is even worse. I just realized that portal isn't centered. <laughs> the ship portal and all of the portals attached to it are not centered properly. I just realized that. I do actually really like the lava stand out here, though. I actually really like that. I don't like the invisible flying hitboxes there. I know, what a shock. Yeah, look, they are not centered to the spikes. God, this level, man. I'm happy you can hug the floor. Cause that's a bit of a crapshoot in, um, in funny game levels, even in his older work. 
God, that- Why do you add that shit? So Just like, look, this will die because the part like like a mother -fucker. So can we just talk about the fact that I'm playing on an LDM and my FPS is still dropping to 200 here? What objects are causing me that much lag? Why is there no S block there? Put a blind transition, at least make it work. Yay. Yeah, not my favorite. Play test your LEMs. No, I didn't like it. 195. I thought it took way more than that. <laughs> I was so off with my thought. I thought it would have been like 700. <laughs> 195 is so little. Um, below cutter knife, above Nova, because Nova is even less playable. At least Thanatos has some cool ideas, I guess. Cool. Let's move on to... I think I have a couple of non-demons now, so that's that's good for my mental health. Mysterio, my funny game once again. Oh great, another one of these parts. These parts play like shit, by the way. Don't add them to your level. The part looks kind of cool. I like the foresty look. It's going to have shit transitions. Oh, won't you Look at that. Oh wow, that's so cool. That can happen. Oh my god! What the f is happening to my frame rate? This is so disgustingly laggy. Great, I hate that part. It was cool once. That transition is um not great. Yay. I can't rank that high because of how much it lags at the end. Mysterio. Mysterio. Um, yeah, no, I don't think... I don't like a lot of these levels. I really don't. Persona. At least these levels are free as hell, so... It's just a remake of one of his other levels. One of the uh, originals. No, there's a coin somewhere. Wow. 110 frames. What object? What is causing me this much lag? This is sick. Wow, what a good transition. I have to do a practice run of the 7 star because the transition is that good. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> nah, guys, nobody copy pastes. Funny game would never copy paste. And then these have the smallest hitboxes I've ever seen. What is happening? Why? Are there are two spikes. Tree! Okay, that was kind of a, the best level of his that I've played in a very long time. Persona. I'll put it below Deadly Storm. I liked it a bit, I guess. Majesty, a hard demon. Oh no. Oh, 5% of practice mode. That's the worst of signs. No. Did he put invisible portals? Why? You're such a fucking loser. <laughs> Like that one part has to be the only reason it's hard demon. I can't believe that. That was that part is so shit. It's like the hitbox of these. <laughs> yep, that was about what I expected to see. But yeah, no, so far the only actual difficult part is the wave, which is a ridiculous fucking choke point. This is all just bad. No! Stop it! You. <laughs> Wow, an improvement over Proxima and basically nothing else. This is a very mediocre playing level with these two waves that carry this into being a 3 out of 100 enjoyment rating. Specifically the second one can go suck my dick. For those that are wondering what's so bad about this level, you see these arrows? Yeah, they aren't actually arrows, they decide what site what wave has to go on. My god, that is maybe the worst gimmick I've ever seen made in human f history. Plus the waves have different hitbox on both sides, so these waves become pure muscle memory, which is garbage. Plus in the second part, the coins aren't for a coin, they are for your survival. It took me legit 1000 attempts to do this full last wave a single time, which should never happen in any hard demon. I also got unlucky, so that's just great. This is, in my opinion, his second worst level. So yes, this is of course going in F tier. F this level. After f***ing nine days or so, finally f beat Majesty or whatever the hell that's called. Yeah, Majesty. What a pile of rubbish. This cost me almost two k- yeah, 1840 attempts. It cost me a thousand attempts to do the last wave one time. Three. Absolutely never in your life play this shit. That's all you need to know. <sighs> Great track record you've had, new funny game. Jesus Christ. So it did look good. Yeah, that feels about right. That feels right. <sighs> like there's <laughs> nobody beats this shit for a good reason. One level and then we're up to the last page. Gamora. You're a Gamoron. Wow! I'm playing this in practice because funny game, new funny game can't make gameplay for shit. Wow, what a good coin. How is this lagging? There's no objects on the screen. Dude, learn how to optimize. Can you slide on these? 
Of course you can't. What a stupid question. It's funny game. He doesn't know how to make gameplay anymore. New funny game. What? Why? 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 Just fix your f***ing level instead of putting an invisible slope there. It looks cool. That's it. Just... The intro is like 15% of the level. Mean. I 20 seconds of my life, I will never get back. Oh my god, that's so boring. Mom, look, I placed my first coin. Like, why Why is there so much spam in your levels? Like, with this type of structuring, yeah, creating does seem easy. Clip through, whoa, what a hacker mode. Also, how the f*** is this a sick, uh, like a 4 or 5 star? This should probably be more like a 7 star. Especially with how ass the transitions are. I have no clue if the floor kills you or not, so I'm just going to stay up here. Well, Gamora. Wow, what a masterpiece. Um, there Gamora is. It's like... High beater around here. It's pretty good. Just the gameplay's so whack. Like it's so whack. Wait, I beat Titanium Buster, right? I did. Oh, <gasps> I forgot. I forgot to rank it. I hated this level. High D tier. I did not like that level. I do remember it. So I did miss one. Haha. <laughs> I had a feel. Ooh. Because I have one page left. And so that's max 10 levels. Yeah, th these are the last 10 levels. This is correct. Yeah. Because these are all rated. I'll start with Untitled then. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm blind. Okay, good to know that these are all slidey. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of optimization, like I'm not asking for this to be perfectly optimized because I can see how goddamn annoying this type of stuff must be to perfectly optimize. But you can easily shave, shave like a couple thousand objects out of every single part. <laughs> oh my god, these are dash orbs, you can't see them for shit. I think this tries a bit too hard to be futuristic and cool and awesome. Now it just looks ugly as hell. I can barely see what's an orb, it's so weird. Isn't this like a five star? <laughs> Why? And why do these kill you? The gems in the previous part didn't. What a great transition. Wow. Why don't you just remove the blocks there? So what was the recommended star amount? Four star. No. How is that a four star? What cracked ass four stars have you been playing? Why are they moving towards you? Wow, I'm, I suck. <laughs> to be fair, this is like not a five star at all. <laughs> Probably still better optimized than the 144 hertz joke in 80x. It's a five star. Come on, man. Fuck you! Yeah, I did indeed drop the five star yesterday. I was so done. Why isn't it working? It froze. So you can thankfully you couldn't see me dying to the worst shit ever. I'm so gaming now. A oh, wave. I forgot already. God, I, I recalibrated the SEO device and now it's just ever so slightly different. Yeah, it's very slightly more sensitive, which <laughs> my muscle memory. I think my muscle memory is already adjusted. Oh yeah, this part lags like a mother <laughs> How the hell is this a five star, by the way? What the, <laughs> what bullshit is that? Oh, you can do that. That's fun. Funny game trying to make something playable challenge impossible. Ooh, now I'm going to the end of the level. I actually do not remember a single thing. I forgot how fucking <laughs> awful that transition was. That's where I died. Yes, the parallaxes have hitboxes, which makes them awful parallaxes. Do these, do those pray? Yeah, they- Oh, uh, funny game! Oh, I'm already bored again. God, this all is so shit to play. It's like the hardest five star in the entire game or something. I, I have to do so many inputs. I mean, ship orbs in a five star is kind of f***ed up. Ooh, let's go. Don't die to the robot. Not that jump. Okay, cool. Well, I've basically epicked the victory royale. I've eager hacked the version two. Oh, this shit robot transition. There you go. Funny game trying to make a playable level challenge. Impossible edition. That's number 50. It's a How the hell am I on the leaderboard? That's actually so pathetic. <laughs> I didn't even beat the level with coins. Ah, EOA on air. Funny game. <laughs> I have to add a laughing emoji to my own tier list because it's funny and game. Um, untitled. It lags. It has shit gameplay, but at least it looks kind of cool. I just described every single new funny game level. Ooh, there is room for improvement. Why the hell do I have that level liked? <laughs> what the hell is that gap? Funny game. I clicked and then I got a coin. What am I doing? How am I li alive? 
Huh? That's a spike. Oh, come on. Wow. Why is there a boss fight? Oh, great. Spam. Wait, what? What is happening? The rest of the level is actually okay. And then you have the shittest boss fight I've ever seen in my entire life. Medium demon, by the way. Good transition. I love that transition. Money game. What? The transitions are just so shit. Oh yeah, no, of course, because you can really see that there's a flippy flip portal there. To be fair, that's a mistake that even creators nowadays still make. Can't blame him that much for that one. But I'm going to. I'm sorry, I have to be more censored. Um, tiddle my fiddy winkers. Wow. Gosh, diddly darn it. <laughs> my rumples have officially been still skinned. No bug fixie? Trying to find a bug in a modern funny game level is like trying to find a mosquito outside. It's just everywhere you look, it's just purely buggy and mosquito-y. Thank you, God. Ooh, here we go. Here we go. So cheesy. I completely forgot this part was there. Whoa, it's Wolfie. And he loves GD colon. I am going to do another practice run. Ooh, 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 ooh. Well, you should touch the first leg so you could just chill on the bottom. Okay, cool. Then the middle and spam then hope you don't die. Okay, I just did the entire boss. <laughs> just a bit of hoping and praying because the boss fight once again has a couple of absolutely awful attacks. We can continue on with the video gaming power. Ah, yes, I know how to balance my levels. Bunny game said. <laughs> I was thinking like three parts ahead. Wow, that wave is actually... I don't even think it's hard. I was just lagging so much. Wave is so much harder when you're lagging. I mean, this is so far by far the best gameplay he's made, which is pretty sad because the gameplay is not great. Like zaro -y, and I hate Zaro's gameplay. I don't know, this kind of works. Coin. Chill on the ground, chill in the middle. I completely forgot to spam. <laughs> I absolutely fully forgot that you had to spam there. Why does that only appear after a meal? Go here. Wow! You could really see where you could die. Wow! I really knew exactly the hitboxes of the thing that killed me, thankfully. <laughs> Great platform, bro. Why am I this bad? Yesterday evening, for me at least, um, the 2.2 trailer came out and you know 2.2 got delayed to november which i was expecting anyway considering the amount of issues the amount of downtime the servers were having i kind of expected it to be delayed it's fine um the trailer is absolutely incredible <laughs> the trailer is so good why is it so good i actually wasn't that excited for 2.2 at first but now i am that trailer fully sold me on on the entire update after all these years especially the icons part like oh my god over 700 new icons is so many i know the first couple of days probably the servers are going to crash instantly which i'm really looking forward to seeing i'm just so excited now and yes you can actually chill on the ground for once future yay the level is done. Actually, relatively fun. I liked it. That's weird to say. It's flawed, but it's good. I liked it. For once. 118 attempts for spyware. I don't think that should... Well, should that be a medium demon? Maybe. It's definitely not a higher end medium demon. Yeah, 118. I'm, I have IQ. I'd say still approach with caution, but at least to step up. I didn't hate that. I really didn't hate that. Maybe my standards for what's fun have decreased, probably, to be honest. Oh my god, I'm not looking forward to two-faced agony. Then there's hypocrisy and then there's Tron, which I don't even know if I'm gonna do Tron. Oh my god, I, this is on my bucket list. This has been on my bucket list for years. I'm finally going to be forced to play it. Um, I just want to put into perspective how hard this level is. I'm going to report Majesty to the hard demon list though, because that level is not a... Wow, what a great set of levels. Okay, it's 123, just like middle to lower end extended list, but it's still one of the hardest insane demons in the game. <laughs> this level is hard. Like, ED is very difficult. I already have 462 old attempts, but I'm just gonna count those in. Let's first do a practice run, then I'll see what parts are more difficult than others. Great, it uses a f nine circle song. This is also one of those pseudo memory levels. I can't see shit. Where am I? I have done this wave before, by the way. This entire wave, you can't notice. Great shardscapes design. This level came out before shardscapes. I just realized that I am going to have to beat this. Oh my God, that timing is ass. Yeah, this timing is really not good. Okay, that was a doable, I guess. Oh, here we go. This is the migraine factory. That dual wave was actually a lot more straightforward than I thought most. <laughs> I've just done Majesty, which has like the most annoying version of that dual wave. Where it actually forces you to pick a side and always 
one of the same sides. Yeah, this is how you make this type of gameplay somewhat okay. But oh, that's a great click. This is going to cost me so much time to learn still. No shot that that's actually just a... That's such a mean click. Can I pass through this part? Like a kidney stone. I don't know. Okay, so some parts are a lot more difficult than others. So far, this seems doable. I know that this ending is absolute dog shit, so... I hate this part so much. This is like the worst gameplay. This part gives me a migraine and a half. This is such a hard part for me to look at. This is the exact type of thing that my eyes can't handle for shit. I'm, I have to beat this on low detail mode. Verified by Cycle, the guy that made True Fat. I do like it though. I'm pissed off. I'm mad. Just edited the last recording. I have edited all of them and it corrupted. Not the editing, but the original file just decided to corrupt. So, um, you didn't see me play the last couple of levels, which sucks, but whatever. The Void, FP, Torn Dimension, Shattered Space, and his uh hysterical i think yeah no i didn't have much commentary on them anyway so you didn't miss much but it's still sad speaking of sad i i don't have time to beat the last three levels at least not right now maybe in the future well probably in the future i will just not right now so i'm just going to rank them based on what i f how i feel about them as of right now which means that two-faced agony is going to be the only new funny game level in s tier because i think that level's sick it's laggy which is like the only thing that brings it down and this wave in the thumbnail is pretty mediocre but the rest is really cool uh hypocrisy this level's just too long. At least it's kind of cool, so I'll put it above hysterical, maybe. Yeah, no, above hysterical. And then Tron is going to go into low C tier because it, you can't run it. On ULDM, this level lags. Probably if I'd beaten it, it would go into F tier. <laughs> but I haven't, so that's a blessing in disguise. Let me just add the other levels that got lost. So those are, if I am not mistaken, auto base after base. Going right with the rest of its auto friends. And and Sirius, which is also going... I don't remember exactly where I put it. It's not that important. I would probably say it's it's around Funny Game Holiday. So this is for now my final tier list. Yeah, I will update the... Um, the icon so that everything's included and i'll put it in this, this tier list in the description so you can make your own and yeah that's it for now thank you for watching this probably over an hour long piece <laughs> this was a lot of work so like and subscribe for more eeker hacker version 2 so yeah a surprisingly mixed bag but still i would consider funny game the goat of geometry dash creating even though he literally made my least favorite level in the game his influence is still being felt today and for however long this game stays alive to come Funny Game Proof GD was just more than a $4 cube game. Is someone going to challenge his throne? Well, that's for next time.